Oil and gas companies are responsible for a network of thousands of kilometres of pipeline across the world. Ensuring pipeline integrity in corrosive environments is a critical aspect of ongoing operations. NPL is working with both industry and academia to understand typical failure mechanisms and mitigate the risk of loss of containment. In sour crude oil pipelines, the risk of sulphide stress corrosion cracking is highest at wells due to the thermal and mechanical damage induced by the welding process. Recent work at NPL has investigated the effect of typical welding procedures on sulphide stress corrosion cracking of stainless steel pipeline materials. Coarse grinding is commonly used to prepare pipeline surfaces for welding. Even surfaces that appear smooth to the naked eye contain surface defects and grinding grooves. Pitting corrosion tends to initiate at these defects and can lead to cracking of the material. Here we see an image of a typical corrosion pit in stainless steel that developed during exposure to a sour environment at high temperature. Surface cracks can be seen emanating from each side of the pit. Looking sideways at the pit, we can see that there is significant undercutting of the surface. The pit and associated surface cracks have been imaged in 3D at NPL using scanning electron microscopy and focused ion beam lithography. In this procedure, a beam of high energy gallium ions is used to blast away very thin 50 nanometer slices of material, while electron microscope images are captured between each slice. This allows us to observe the pitting and cracking damage beneath the surface of the material and link it to the local microstructure. We can see that the localized attack tends to follow slip lines beneath the surface that were introduced during grinding. This work has identified that coarse grinding in preparation for welding can be detrimental to the integrity of pipeline materials. A practical solution would be to carry out progressive grinding of the surface from coarse to increasingly fine grinding to minimize the damage induced in the material. NPL will incorporate guidelines for industry on recommended grinding procedures in upcoming revisions to welding standards such as ISO 17781. This is just one example of how NPL's world-leading research in corrosion and environment-assisted cracking has had significant impact on best practice in the oil and gas industry. For more information, follow this link.